Hey everyone, I'm here to tell you why you should take everything you see on the internet, especially a video with a grain of salt. If you notice here, I'm on Coinbase, and looky looky, Ripple has been added to Coinbase. That's amazing, you should definitely buy your Ripple now. Uh, but wait a minute, Coinbase has also added a thing called TurdCoin. I've never heard of TurdCoin, and look, I can totally click around and I can highlight it, and it's actually on, like, this is the Coinbase website, look at this. How they've added TurdCoin. I should totally. I need to do all my research on TurdCoin now and figure out what it is and get in before before everybody else does, so I can make my hundred X gains. Right? No, don't believe everything you see on the internet. Now maybe Ripple is going to be on Coinbase eventually. Cool, that'd be great. Awesome. The more coins uh, that are traded, the better, I guess. Whatever. But. Uh, you may see something like this as a screenshot and think, wow, it's so easy uh, to Photoshop that, but you can actually kind of do that on the web too um, and make something that's more believable. So any competent web developer could come in and copy Litecoin from here uh, and then paste it into this area and then uh, move that footer back to the bottom of the page and then let's change this to, I don't know, Amazon Coin. Sure, that might happen someday. Amazon, I spelled it correctly. And then we'll just make this, uh, let's call it AMZ. Cool. Uh, and then let's say the color is whatever color Bitcoin is because I'm too lazy to come up with a custom color. So we'll come in and we'll change the color to make it look more realistic. Nice. And then we need an Amazon logo. Luckily, I have an Amazon coin SVG image. I can come and copy this code which is basically the outline of the SVG. And I can come in here, let's find that guy, and let's paste it, and there we go. It's a little big, I should have scaled it a little better, but uh, I could have done that in Illustrator and then pasted it in. Look at that, Amazon coin. Hey, Ethereum, maybe that's not even really how much Ethereum I have. I could be bullshitting you, and actually, I might be. I could come in here, and if I wanted to make myself feel awesome, I could come and say I have 407 Ethereum. Look at that. Now I'm rich, and I just want to change this to, I don't know, 600,000. And I don't know, I want like 40,000 Bitcoins. Cool. Oh, well, I broke their website layout a little bit. I'm betting most people in Coinbase don't have 40,000 uh, Bitcoins or they have some sort of better layout for that. Uh, look at that. And I'll come make myself a millionaire. Look at that. And now, just through simple Chrome developer tools, I am now a millionaire. That's fantastic. Uh, so get in on TurdCoin and all this other bullshit on Coinbase as soon as you possibly can because everything you see on the internet is real and we should definitely hype all sorts of stuff just because uh, you can see it in somebody's web browser and they're scrolling and they're able to highlight stuff so that definitely means it has to be real. You know what, while we're at it, let's change Ripple to, uh, I don't know, it shouldn't be XRP, maybe it's BSC. There we go, now Ripple is called BSC and it's true because it's on the internet and I can scroll and that means it's true. And uh, thanks for watching, hopefully you, uh, don't buy into all the hype of things you see in people's web browsers because that is a good way to be bullshitted 24-7. Thanks.